So with that, let's just start um, you know, today's uh, session. Uh, today's session is very crisp and very clear. I have actually uh, made an agenda of today's uh, session being the last day. I'll keep it also open for people to share their results towards the end. So first, um, uh, we would just start empowering our inner child. Now that you have met your inner child on the day one, second uh, day you have started building the rapport. Third and the fourth day, you have understood how the inner child got wounded. And um, then in the last uh, fourth day, I mean, it was yesterday itself, right? That how uh, you are healing the inner child. Now it is your responsibility that if you have healed the inner child, you're going to make her feel the same, uh, you know, longer, for a longer duration of time or for, for the matter, like always to make her feel comfortable, to make him feel healed. How do you make that? You will have to just start, uh, you know, empowering her. So we are going to do this exercise, a very short exercise, a very, very nice and loving energy you will experience today when you do this exercise with me. And I want you to do this exercise every day. Other uh, segments in the Inner Child Healing Challenge, whichever I have covered, you can probably like yesterday's session, which I have done with all of you guys, the guided meditation. You can do it twice in a week or once in a week. But this one, which I'm going to do today, if you if you can do it every day, you will see a significant difference in your self-love, in your self-concept, which is getting beautifully transformed. Um, the confidence is getting you know, boosted. So, so many multiple benefits you will start experiencing in you as your inner child starts feeling uh, the same vibration which we have developed yesterday. And it is just to retain that beautiful feeling in her. So, it should not be the case that you heal her and then after a few days, she again starts feeling uh, you know, hurt, uh, for all the past wounds or whatever she has gone through. So it is now responsibility of us to make her maintain the same uh, healing power so that she starts feeling this power every single day. All right. So, uh, yeah. All right. So everyone take a seat. Uh, keep your back absolutely erect. No bending, no movements, um, no talking. <laughs> Completely focused on the uh, session. Right. So take a seat and uh, keep your back erect if you want you can take a childhood photograph of yours if it is there with you uh, if it is in another phone and the phone is with you you can open that uh, picture on your phone also but if you're connected through the same phone on youtube live uh, don't worry that's absolutely fine you can visualize your uh, ch inner child and you can do the exercise with me don't get stressed that's what i'm saying <laughs> no need to close your eyes one instruction i want to give all of you guys if you feel like staring on the wall uh, which is also fine okay all that you need is just concentrate or if you feel I would suggest you not to look in the screen because sometimes when you look in the screen you will have you you will start getting a lot of thoughts okay so either you start gauging on the wall or you can simply close your eyes if you really want to go within you you can close your eyes you can look at me also that's absolutely fine so you can also look look, look in the screen if you still want to Feel that, okay, I'm sitting next to you and I'm making you do this exercise. Keep looking at me. That is also absolutely fine. I don't want to stop anybody <laughs> from doing that. Okay. All right. So I am just starting it right now. And we're going to have some fun and we are going to make the inner child feel extremely powerful. So that's my promise. Everyone take a deep breath. And relax. One more time, take a deep breath, relax. If you really want to close your eyes, you can actually close your eyes. But you just want to gauge on the screen or on the wall, it's absolutely fine. Or on the ground, anything is fine, right? And I want you to just process your emotions with this music while thinking about your inner child. So I'm just increasing the volume a little bit for you know few seconds. Just focus on the music. right now take a deep breath everyone and 
relax. One more time. Take a deep breath. When you are taking the deep breath, expand your belly and lungs. Exhale. Keep feeling relaxation throughout your body with the music. Just focus on your breath. Focus on the inner child. Keep thinking about him or her. Doesn't matter whether you are closing or opening your eyes. Doesn't matter. All right. Now I want you to just repeat after me whatever I would be saying right now, and we. we want to feel as if whatever we are saying right now is absolutely true in our life right we want to make her believe that this is what she is this is what he is and this is how we feel you know for her so feel whatever i will say you will have to say them loudly um if you feel that you are not in a situation to say loudly you can say that in your mind but i strongly strongly suggest you to say it loudly right so that your five senses can get super activated all right so let's get started keep thinking about your inner child the face the outfit she is or he is wearing if she or he is inside the house outside the house keep thinking about him or her and now with this just repeat after me i am worthy of love and acceptance just as i am once again i am worthy of love and acceptance just as i am you can even put your right hand on your heart it's totally up to you now repeat the next one think about your inner child and feel the inner child inside you saying this i release all fears and embrace my inner child with compassion Once again, I release all my fears and embrace my inner child with so much compassion. So feel that as if all your past hurts, past fears are just getting released, and your inner child is now super comfortable with you. Right? Let's go to the next one. Say this with me: I forgive myself, and I release all my past hurts. Once again. I forgive myself and I release all my past hurts. I honor and nurture my inner child's needs and desires. Once again, I honor and nurture my inner child's needs and desires. So feel as if she she keeps, you know, sharing her desires with you. and you keep fulfilling her desires like that small small simple simple desires she has for example she wants to spend some time with you she wants to probably have some chocolates she wants she wants to go for a walk with you you are there to honor and nurture her as you are there to just take care of your, her needs and desires from now on so say this again with me i honor and nurture my inner child and desires Let, let's go to the next one i am safe protected and divinely loved once again i am safe protected and divinely loved my is a source of joy and creativity once again my inner child is a source of joy and creativity so now think about yesterday's uh, visual where she was just you just healed her and she is just running with joy crossing that bridge over the river and she is just waving at you and you feel so relaxed so happy that you have healed her so once again say this my inner child is a source of joy and creativity i am and complete just as i am once again i am whole and complete just as i am I trust the process of healing and growth. Once again, I trust the process of this healing and growth. I am safe. I am loved 
and I am divinely protected by the universe. So feel that white light around you just like a protection bubble which is just protecting you 24 by 7 unconditionally. So say, say this with me again, I am safe, I am loved and I am divinely protected by the universe. My inner child is free to express and be heard. Once again, my inner child is free to express everything and be heard. So feel how beautiful the inner child feels when she is able to have that rapport with you. She is or he is sharing everything she feels with you because now she knows you are always there to be with her or him. Once again, my inner child is free to express and be heard. I embrace my past and I create a bright future. Once again, my I embrace my past and I create a bright future. I am healing and growing stronger every day with the inner child healing. Once again, I am healing and growing stronger every day with the inner child healing. My inner child is safe, loved and cherished always. Once again, my inner child is safe, loved and cherished always. I am free to express my true self. Once again, I am free. So open your arms and say I am free to express my true self. So feel what if you have got the freedom from now on for lifelong that you can actually express everything you feel every moment. You don't have to feel that you will be judged. You don't have to feel that you need to hold that resistance. Why should I express myself? But as your inner child is free to express, you start feeling this in your nervous system and you feel I am free to express my true self. I am a loving and a compassionate guardian to my inner child. Once again, I am a loving and compassionate guardian to my inner child. Once again, I am a loving and compassionate guardian to my inner child. Now feel as if you are just holding her or holding him in your arms and she feels so safe with you. She feels that this Reconnection is so special for her and as she starts feeling so special, she is giving that power to you because from now on, she is going to feel powerful, she is going to feel safe, she is going to feel protected, she is going to feel loved every single moment in the day and the same vibration is going to vibrate in your nervous system. So once again, I am a loving and compassionate guardian to my inner child and now just look at her or look at him and say thank you thank you thank you for being there in me thank you for giving me this clarity thank you for giving me this opportunity to heal you thank you universe thank you higher energy for this awareness i'm sorry please forgive me thank you and i really love my inner child once again i'm sorry please forgive me Thank you and I really, really love my inner child. Once again, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you and I really love myself and my inner child. Now just feel this vibration in your body when you start accepting yourself the way you are because the inner child has just started accepting her. You start feeling so safe. You start feeling so much of love for yourself. You are now ready to let go of all the past wounds and create a brighter future. So take a deep breath and relax. Once again, take a deep breath and relax. Now gently open your eyes and I'm giving you some two to three minutes Quickly grab your notepad and pen and I want you to write a gratitude letter to your inner child. So express your love, express whatever you feel like, you know, for her, how she is empowering you. Write the gratitude letter right now. Just 
whatever comes to your mind randomly don't try to manipulate don't try to resist just let yourself express so keep writing you have another 2 minutes or 3 minutes feel the music and keep writing with this beautiful vibrations in your nervous system and keep a big smile on your face while you're writing a gratitude letter because you should be smiling so no frowny faces no sad faces express with lots of love and with a big smile so keep writing you have another 1 minute it's okay if you're not able to finish it after this session you can just finish whatever you know are left over uh, or or whatever you start processing in your nervous system you can just keep writing right keep writing no cheating and if you're done you can probably just do couple of rounds of hope no no All right so we are done with the exercise uh quickly write in the chat box and let me know if you were able to write the gratitude letter it is okay if you haven't finished it you can take your time after the session please complete that right and um, uh, this is very important because when you write something it goes straight to your subconscious right so reading is important but then when you write something as i said writing is as powerful as like reading five times and you write once it is equivalent to that <laughs> right okay all right so one quick word in the chat box how you are feeling when you have actually empowered her and now you are taking the responsibility of retaining this beautiful vibrations uh, accepting the way you are because the inner child is going to make you feel the same every single day from now on right so it is very essential take the responsibility of your inner child that the more i empower her the more she can feel comfortable within me and the you know the best i can feel every day and if you can carry this kind of vibrations every single day 30 days can you imagine the kind of magic you can build around you you can feel as if whatever relationship issues you have you are so easily able to forgive them right the burdens the the so much of heaviness that you have been carrying in your mind in your shoulders uh, as if you feel that somehow you're now able to feel it's okay maybe that was a lesson which the universe wanted to let me know had i not gone through those past wounds in my life i would not have been here doing the inner child healing or making the bond stronger with my inner child how many of you can feel yeah this is powerful raise your hands and say yes it is powerful because i now start blessing all my past wounds 